hello today we will see how to hide or unhide folder or file by attrib command in windows so the attrib command is very powerful to hide the folders completely even when we click on show hidden files or folder it does not display so for that we will open our e drive uh, let's open e drive in the e drive I have one games folder to hide games folder first go to the command prompt cmd now in the command prompt we will go to e drive in the e drive we have games folder so to hide we will write a double t r i b a trip plus s plus h plus r here a trip indicates the attribute plus s indicate that it will create a file as a system file plus h indicates that it will hide the file and plus r means it will give the read only access to the file or a folder now we'll pass our folder name which is games games okay press enter now in the e drive we can see that games folder is not visible let's refresh it's not visible so if we will now go to organize folder and search option click on the view and then show hidden files folder and drives apply ok here still we can see that games folder is not visible even that hide folder is visible which I have I have hide that generally by the folder and search option OneDrive temp is available but that games folder is not available here in other words I can say that uh, games folder is here but it's not visible let's again go to organize folder and search option and don't show hidden file folders or drives apply ok so now still uh, games folder is not visible but is accessible so to access the games folder we can write here the folder name games and the folder is open again if we go to e drive we can see that games folder is not visible however uh, as on the record it maintains that we opened the games folder so to completely hide the folder it's better to clean the history or clean the temporary files so that it should not be viewable that we have one more folder in the e drive okay so now we can check that uh, uh, still the games folder is there uh, again let's run the C cleaner close it games uh, C cleaner yes run cleaner Now uh, we can see that uh, here the folder name is not uh, shown and even that folder is hidden we can only uh, as if now access this folder by passing the folder name here or the one more way to see a system hidden folder is that we can go to organize against folder and, and search option view and here we have the option hide protected operating system file so let's unhide the operating system files yes show hidden files folder and drives apply ok so we can see that games folder is visible here but still it's in the hidden mode 
or if again we will change it to its hide protected operating system files and after then that the folder is hidden now to unhide the folder again we can pass a trip this time uh, minus s minus h and minus r then folder name again here attribute indicates the attribute uh, s is for system file h is for hidden and r is for uh, read only per uh, attributes now here let's refresh games folder is visible here apart from that we can uh, hide the folder and after then that we can uh, deny the access permission to the folder as well in order to get the additional security for our folder so let's see that we can go to our folder let's again pass our command sorry so as we have seen by this the folder is hi hidden as it is a system folder and now it's a hidden with read, read only access permissions now <coughs> uh, we can provide the security also uh, here we'll pass the folder name So we have provided the additional security to our folder. Now the folder is not visible here. Even if someone knows the folder name, uh, let's say I know the folder name is games. Oh, it's an access is denied. And even uh, if we will unhide the folder. So now we can see that uh, we have uh, not we have access is denied for us. So even we can not unhide the folder now. So what we have to do is is we'll go to our directory and uh, then we will see the header uh, operating system files. So the file name is games we can see that we have provided the access permissions so security on security we can see that uh, on every one we have the denied access let's edit allow access for everyone apply okay okay after then that if you go to command from again and type the same command and now our folder is available here and again let's correct everything and that's it here we have done